Hey everybody, Scott here from AtlasCollectibles.com and we got a new standard video for you today here on MTG Arena and perhaps one of my favorite uh, decks is Bant Fog um, mostly because it's in the band colors and plays this card here it's a fairy hero of Dominaria, busted over the top, one of the best planeswalkers ever printed um, alongside Nexus of Fate, our take extra turn spell <coughs> And basically what this deck um, uh, is looking to do is not let your opponent play magic. You want them to uh, go, you know, play some creatures, play some spells, attack you, and then have nothing happen. goes back to your turn, eventually you build up enough of a mana base between uh, your 25 lands, Gift of Paradise, Teferi also, um, with the untap ability giving you a little bit extra mana, especially with Gift of Paradise, my, my god that combo is awesome. And then you can use all that extra mana to cast Nexus of Fate. Keep casting Nexus of Fate over and over and over again until you ultimate uh, Teferi and eventually win the game by uh, making uh, constructs with Karn. And the way you keep finding your Nexus of Fate is uh, search for Scanta. So eventually you'll get to enough mana where you can tap search, uh, touch, uh, tap uh, Escanta the Sunken Ruin find Nexus of Fate, cast Nexus of Fate, maybe even do some other stuff, and keep up to King um, Teferi, Ultimate Teferi, and if your opponent has not conceded by then, then you can uh, use Karn, minus, make some constructs, <coughs> attack your opponent, and eventually win the game. Uh, moving over to the sideboard, we have um, not too much to talk about, I'll switch the view here, uh, just so everybody can see, okay, here we go. So we got four copies in the gate, um, you know, to win some counter fights, deal with some planeswalkers, sorcerer spyglass to deal with some more planeswalkers. That's the, that's the type of thing that this tech has a hard time beating. Uh, Knight of Autumn to deal with our enchantments, um, you know, in the white red um, or mono white aggro decks that utilize um, Conclave Tribunal and or. Ixalan's Binding, uh, Knight of Autumn takes care of those pretty good and gives us a body for blocking. Cleansing Nova is a catch-all board wipe, uh, deals with Carnage Tyrant quite nicely. And three copies of our own Carnage Tyrant to deal with uh, control decks, uh, as well as one copy of Nuzzle Hall. Alright, so that's the deck, guys. We'll see you in uh, round one. Alright, guys, welcome to round one. We're going to be on the draw in this round. Sand looks like keepable hand. And it looks like we're against White Weenie. Go ahead and lead off on Temple Garden. So they go. Hunted Witness. Pretty quick start for our opponent here. Land, say go. We can utilize this blink of an eye if we need to. If our opponent gets off to, uh, to a quick start. Oof, that would be a quick start. I think we'll go ahead and use it. I'm not really sure how much of a benefit this happens because they just they do get to replay it anyway. Um, this could end up being a mistake, but we'll see. We do get to gain some life here. We'll take a big hit in the following turn, but I still think we're in pretty good shape. Root Snare is not a bad draw. I wouldn't mind hitting another land, though. Uh, hitting another land actually gives us the best curve out that this deck can get. Because we get to uh, play our land, play Teferi, untap, and leave up uh, Root Snare and or pause for a reflection. Holy smokes, another one. Well, at least we can get a hit. Uh, we can get uh, that beating that we probably deserved. But... Um, we did draw land. We'll go ahead and use Teferi's ability, see what we got. That's just fantastic. Untap a couple of lands. We got pause for reflection. At the ready. <clears throat> I'll be curious to see if our opponent uh, plays around uh, settle the following turn. We were not representing Settle the Wreckage mana last turn, but uh, we are now. 
Teferi draws us another root snare. And we'll say you no know, yeah. Play we'll play Karn. As we get to untap untap these lands anyway. I don't really care what our opponent gives us here. Untap and we got five mana available. Alright, opponent goes immediately to combat. It looks like they are gonna play around settle of the wreckage. It's fairly odd that they would just attack a planeswalker. I don't know. I I find that attack uh, a little odd, but so we'll go ahead and uptech Karn. See what we hit here. I'm assuming we're getting the Temple Garden, and that was correct. Let's see what we hit with the fairy. We are going to get to ultimate this to fairy. We we have essentially uh, three fogs available with uh, with Karn's minus next turn. We can get back mission briefing, and that represents either a, a pause, another pause for reflection, or root snare. We'll see what our opponent, uh, how our opponent attacks this turn. Okay. We'll just go root. We'll just go ahead and root snare. Nothing special. Just protect this to fairy. Yep. We'll minus Karn. We'll get back our mission briefing. And now this represents another fog. Let's go ahead and play Gift of Paradise on our basic island. I don't think this matters too much. We'll have Tick Teferi. Let's see what we get. Go ahead and play Search. It's a very good draw. We'll pass and we'll untap four mana because this combo is allowed to be a thing. Sure. Mm-hmm. I think we'll go settle here. So we're about to ultimate this to fairy and we want to keep keep as many things off the board as we can here. We will keep that. That represents exiling two things. Whoop, 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 whoop. No, 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 no. Let's cancel that. That was close. Play Teferi, uptick, exile something. Probably, yeah. We'll get rid of the 6-6 six, six here. Minus Karn. We get back our fog. Now we are fully protected. And the concession. Fantastic. Alright, let's go to sideboarding here. And... Okay, we definitely want the night and bottoms. And... That's probably pretty close to it. Night of Lunsman, the Cleansing Novas, I think we'll probably do it. Get rid of a blink, a uh, blink of an eye. A couple of the pause for reflections, and that should be good. All right. Game number two. Sand seems all right. We have on Glacial Fortress. Depending on if we draw a land here, I think we'll play Escanta. If 
we don't draw land here, we'll play Discovery to try to hit our land drops. We drew land here, so it's probably more beneficial to play Escanta. Start filtering out those draws. Opponents off to a pretty good start. Con well, that's an aggressive Conclave Tribunal. Play Knight of Autumn. And we'll just take it out. Gives us a nice blocker for these little dorky creatures, too. Well, it looks like we don't have to block this turn. Uh, we don't need uh, Karn. Cast Discovery. Man, I would really like Drew Teferi anyway. See, that's the awkward part with Discovery and Nexus of Fate is you play Discovery, uh, you see an Nexus of Fate that you don't want, now you have to throw it into the bin and then it just shuffles your deck completely so it doesn't really um, apply any filtering. Graveyard Chemistry's Insight, and not draw land. We're still, like, not out of this game yet. As crazy as it sounds, because we do have three Root Snares in hand, so for the next three turns, we don't have to take any damage if we don't want to. The problem is, is we're really behind on our mana. And we're also at three life. Oh, good God. No. There we go. Well, I guess it's play search, another root snare. We we legitimately have to root snare. Um every turn. Until we find a board wipe and or a settle. Yeah, we'll keep the island, and we get to transform Surge. Hey, all of a sudden we have caught back up on mana. Uptick to fairy. Draw a card or draw a forest. Untap a couple of lands. A Conclave Tribunal here gets uh, gets us in a tricky spot. Well, that's even worse. Now we can't even cast another Teferi, even if we draw it. All out attack. Root Snare. More creatures for our opponent. Mission Briefing. It's unfortunate, but these mission briefings do represent two more fogs. Our opponent correctly playing around Settle the Wreckage now. Just, just a little bit of mana short of uh, of being able to either cast Chemistry's Insight or Mission Briefing. Now we are not, so we can repeat this process. Uh, I like both of these. So the way this works is we root snare here. End step will cast chemistry's inside, draw both of those cards. And we get to Knight of Autumn. 
destroy Ixalan's binding, get our three minute fairy. It's it's crazy how much this deck puts up a fight, even even though um, we're pretty close to just losing. Yeah. Go ahead and destroy all the creatures here. I expect our opponent to pay for Adanta Vanguard. They get some vampires back. And still have a bunch of lethal attackers. No matter, we get to root snare here. And no removal spell. Okay, that's good. Go ahead, uptick to fairy. That's not great. We might have to main phase chemistry's insight. Settle the wreckage, okay. Alright, that buys us another turn. I mean, if we actually get the ultimate this to here, we just have a nuts amount of chemistry's insights in the bin. Alright, let's see how our opponent attacks. <laughs> it doesn't matter. We have to settle the wreckage. I'm curious. Okay, so they're just getting planes, so they're just on the mono white plan. Alright, let's. Teferi. Another Teferi does not do it. I think it's better for us to activate search. Or we'll cast the chemistry's insight first. Gift of Paradise doesn't quite do it. Discovery dispersal also does not do it. So we can gift. On a basic. Untap. We have dispersal after we untap the gifted land. And that does actually keep us alive, kind of. One, two, three, four. No, it doesn't. I forgot about the, uh, the token that they could make. Rats. And they have a Conclave Tribunal anyway. Mm. That's unfortunate. Oh, now the, now the Dispersal doesn't even work. Because they just return the Conclave to their hand. Yikes. And that's it. Oh, that was so close. After breaking on lands for a few turns, we were able to come all the way back and it just ended up uh, fizzling slightly. I think that, I think I, I'm pretty sure I had a different out um, instead of the dispersal line. So, um, I'll have to take a look at that one later, but... Yep, this looks okay. We have Gift of Paradise on the basics, basic which is nice. We have uh, Discovery on two. All of our come into play tapped lands come into play untapped. Let's see what we got. Yeah, I like both of these. Go 
ahead and play Gift Paradise. Get back some of that life that we lost. All of the locks it on. And my favorite curve. Let's play Teferi. Untap and we have a root snare. We also have blink of an eye. That's kind of nice. Ugh. Alright. Well, we get to uh, destroy that with Night of Autumn. We'll just take this. Opponent's missing lands. We shall, Knight of Autumn, will destroy this Conclave Tribunal. I'll take the fairy. Okay. Now we actually have Blink of an Eye kicked plus Root Snare. That's kind of nice. Okay. We'll let that go. Sure. I'll just block here. No need to waste this root snare. Kicker, we'll return the conclave. Gift of Paradise is not bad. But I think what I want to do... Can I play Gift and Nexus of Fate? I th think I can. Yes. We'll set a stop on the end step. So when, when you set a stop here, you can click through each and everything that has to resolve within the end step. Go ahead and take another turn. Settle the wreckage is not bad. We have the city's blessing, so we can start drawing off of Arch if we need to. I imagine we'll see a replayed tribunal here. Sure. No, that's fine. History of Benalia. Eh? Draw with Arch. Ah, Cleansing Nova. My favorite. I realize that... Like, if I were to choose Artifacts and Enchantments, I destroy both my Gift of Paradise. But I get to fairy. No, I'll just play to fairy. Yeah, I want to wait until they get their second night from History of Benalia. Sure. Mm -hmm. So I think we just root snare here. We'll draw with arch. Man, I still want to blow up all these. Enchantments. So I think what we're going to do is we're going to tuck a Johnny. We're going to play land. We're going to play Cleansing Nova and destroy all artifacts and enchantments. We're going to keep our new Teferi. Uptick. Play Cleansing Nova and destroy all creatures. And just like that, our opponent has almost nothing left. Ugh.
Next defeat's not a bad draw. <sighs> Mono lands. Uh, we can't quite draw with Arch and play Nexus of Fate, so we'll just cast Nexus of Fate. Search is not bad. Let's draw another search. Not exactly what we're looking for. Untap our lands. We can settle and draw with search. When search flips, it's going to be nice because we can actually search and uh, cast a nexus of fate if we find it. Mm -hmm. I still like where we're at right now. Draw more lands. Uh, hmm. No, it's graveyard that. We have plenty of lands to discard. Oh my goodness, more lands. Alright. Okay. Ecclesial Fortress. Let's take a look, see what we got here. Uh, I think we'll take Saddle. Even though our opponent knows about it, it's fine. And we can actually draw to end of turn. Actually, we're going to untap search. I'd rather save the chemistry as insight for when we ultimate to fairy to exile two things. Mm -hmm. Our opponent's incentivized to attack here, but they, they know about the settle. Settle becomes a lot worse when your opponent knows you have it. It's just going to send... Yeah, just enough at the ferry that I need to use this. Oh, no. All right. Well, we can't take the ferry here. It will take chemistry's insight. Gift of Paradise is not terrible. Hmm. All right. Let's let's play Gift. Cast Chemistry's Insight. Perfect. That is exactly what I was hoping for. Uptick. Draw useless land. One tap gift and uh, another blue source. And we can activate search. Mm hmm. We'll declare blockers first. That's fine, I'll just let this go. Hmm. Mission briefing. Now we can flash back one of these. Uh... Oh yeah, this, I think this game's over now. I like both of those. Flashback Cleansing Nova. Play Cleansing Nova. Four, five, six, and we can actually Nexus of Fate. That's pretty nuts.
and oh, can I say stop here? I think I can. I think I did. We'll untap, and we can chemistry's insight. You can also search as well. Our opponent is deep in the tank. <laughs> Scared a couple of lands. Play Gift to Paradise. And then the basic gives us even more mana. Uptick to Fairy. I said Uptick to Fairy. Another root snare. We're not going to be taking any damage for a really long time. We'll grab a Nexus of Fate. Cast Nexus of Fate. And this game. This game is over. We're just going to go through the motions here. So anything useless we're going to throw in the bin. We'll set another stop on our instep because we can do more stuff. So what we're trying to do here is cast enough things to empty out our library to find these. Uh -huh. Just keep going. I think now what we're doing is we're looking for uh, Karn and there he is. Okay. And uh, if we yeah, we'll put next to it as close as we can. Go ahead, and make a construct. Okay, that's gonna provide a nice chump blocker. Discard an excess to fairy. I'll hang on to the second one though for when I ultimate this first one. I really don't think it should get to that point, but no, that was a mistake. I should have untapped a scanta and well, I drew Nexus of Fate anyway, so it doesn't matter. We shall go to combat. And this is nice because what you're actually seeing is is how this deck uh, is supposed to function in a game where your opponent does not concede. Um, yeah, we'll just tuck away this thing. Now it can't block anymore. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, I want to just use Dispersal to get rid of my opponent's last card. I didn't set a stop. Whatever. <laughs> Well, they'll probably give us the Knight of Autumn, which is fine. We're okay with that. We can function on two next eye, and this gives us a 4-3, so it just speeds up our clock. Next turn, I'll make these guys into 3-3s. Three uh, so we got two turns in the bank. I don't even need to activate Teferi anymore. But I'm going to because it's so much fun. Set a stop. Untap, untap. Dispersal. Make our opponent discard that last card. Chemistry's Insight. We'll... Yeah, we'll just make another construct. So it's 13 power on board, so they're dead next turn. Oh, not quite. No, 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 yeah, they're dead next turn. I, I have another turn floating, but I'll just cast this anyway. Alright. Go to combat, and lethal. Awesome. So, that's how this deck is, is wins when your opponent doesn't concede. So, that was great, guys. We'll see you in round two. Hey, guy, hey everybody. Welcome to round number two. Let's see what we're up against. 
another white based aggro deck it looks like could be red white angels I don't know. starting with the two red white dual lands doesn't uh, doesn't mean too much here we got a good start with search for Escanta. okay so red white angels that's a pretty big uh, pretty big sign you know what I think we'll keep mission briefing go ahead and play gift of paradise Oh, Teferi off the top would just... They, we, we we would win, right? Like, that's just game with Teferi off the top? Holy smokes. Okay. Well, no Teferi off the top. Man, dealing with an Ixalan's Binding main is going to be hard. Once we land Teferi, hopefully they don't have that. Okay, so they're going to get in with Resplendent Angel. That's fine. That costs six mana to activate. Okay, I don't care too much about that. Let's draw two. Alright, well, we can't cast this this search, so... Go ahead and pass again. Arulia, okay. What are they going to buff? Oh, interesting. I would have probably buffed the angel... Because they clearly didn't really care about Settle the Wreckage. They attacked with both creatures anyway. Okay, so... We found a Teferi. And... I think we'll go ahead and play it. <laughs> I don't really want... I don't want to tuck this in. I, 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 can, I can win this game without Search First, can't I? I don't want to tuck this Ixalan's Binding, give them a chance to redraw it, and then play it on my Teferi. Mm-hmm. Yeah, let's say go. I'm actually gonna pass priority back to them after blockers. Uh oh. Okay, so we'll pause. Ah, okay. That doesn't do anything. Yeah, okay. That makes sense. Alright, let's uptick to Fairy and see what we hit. Another land. It's Discovery. Kind of like Karn. I'll play this. We'll see. Go. Is that it? Okay. Mentor, sure. Ugh. Oh, stupid. When you click the land, it kind of resizes itself, but whatever. Maybe we can hit it, get lucky, hit a settle. No, we didn't. Uh, I think I do want the n Nexus of Fate, though. And then we'll just pause for reflection. Okay, so we draw our Nexus. Can, you know, let's play the island. We'll pick to fairy, see what we hit. Oh, Rootsner is fantastic. Oh, that was a mistake. We actually could have played Karn. Waited till our end step untapped and played next phase. That was a mistake. But now I'll just chemistry's insight here. We always have something to do with our mana. Man, having a search first canta on the field would be just fantastic right about now. Alright, so we'll play Karn. We will up to Karn. Oh, I'm assuming we're getting an island. Yeah, we'll 
untap a couple of lands, and we we have uh, Teferi Ultimate next turn. That's probably just going to be a uh, game ending. Mm -hmm. Sure. Root snare. Yep, let's just go back to my turn. We'll save the chemistry's insight for uh the Teferi ultimate. And that's game. That's see that's how the majority of these games usually end. We'll get uh Teferi Teferi Emblem and then uh, concession almost immediately after. So I think we're gonna sideboard almost identical to the way we sideboarded it in the mono white matchup. Cut a blink of an eye, a search, uh two pauses and a discovery, I think. Yeah, discovery. And we'll bring in the two cleansing novas and the three knight of autumns. Same looks good. And by good, I mean average. Like, one blue source, one blue source the same becomes fantastic. And we do have uh, Gift to Paradise. But we did draw the Hinterland Harbor, so. We are Tap Land City, though, so we may as well run out the blue source there so we can run out Search. And we have all the colors we need. Oh, yes. We'll keep that. Just play Gift of Paradise. Pass the turn. Yep, they can hit us for some damage. I think they missed the land drop. We'll graveyard the second search. Play Teferi. Uptick. Uh, if I had uh, waited until I drew with Teferi, I could have played the forest and had Settle Up instead of Root Snare. But, no matter. No damage happens? Oh, shoot. That's okay. It's a good thing we brought in our Knight of Autumns. We'll graveyard, graveyard the root snare, and perfect. Uh, I don't think we need the forest, but we will in fact take this Knight of Autumn. Man, Knight of Autumn is a fantastic card. It's actually been the all-star in these two matches that we played so far. And we can untap, and we actually have Settle the Wreckage up. We'll block here. Sweet. <laughs> the bait worked quite nicely. Kindled Phoenix, eh? Yeah, I think we'll keep Karn. Let's... No. Oh, no. How do I undo? Okay, so it's just Zed. So if you need to undo something in uh, MTG Arena, it's all you don't have to do Control Z. Control actually activates your full controls. So it's just Zed. Guess we're getting an island. We'll play the island. Uptick to ferry. And 
and we'll untap our two gifted lands. Now we have Chemistry's Insight plus Root Snare. Whoa! That I didn't expect. All right. Well, this this is this might be a battle here then. All right. Let's draw a couple cards. Nexus Fate is fine. Ugh. Transform search. Let's just take another turn. We can activate search. Uh, Blink of an Eye is nice. And actually, maybe we'll get in for two. We're taking another turn. So. Let's, yeah, that's Chemistry's Insight. See if we can... Okay, so we didn't hit the... Night of Autumn. Yeah, let's draw a card. We'll draw with Teferi. Draw with Karn. Play Arch. Get the City's Blessing. Can't block, so may as well swing. Ah, I should have untapped one Gifted Land and the Search. Let's see where this Phoenix goes. Okay. <laughs> it's crazy to think, but I am going to protect a Teferi that can't activate. That's that's how good Teferi is. Alright. Let's Chemistry's Insight. We'll discard Temple Garden. See what we got here. See what we got. More useless Teferis. Let's Chemistry's Insight. Discard to Fairy. Ooh, Cleansing Nova's not bad. I think we'll just pass the turn. Oh my goodness. Well, I think next turn is going to be fantastic. Okay. So let's block here, see if they take the bait. And they don't. Okay, so now we're going to settle the wreckage. So this is going to work out well. We're going to... It's going to hurt us a little bit getting rid of our gifted lands. Because we're going to get rid of uh, two, three of them, which really stinks. But, uh, we can deal with that, that's fine. And a resplendent angel? Ugh. Well, ooh, Nexus is nice. So I think, yeah. So let's tap everything for white. And we're going to destroy all artifacts and enchantments. Now we have white mana floating. Um, we'll get back Gift of Paradise. Draw with Teferi. We'll tap correctly. Play it on our basic island, and then now we have enough to, um, we actually have enough to activate search. No, no, 
just we'll just uh, set a stop there and now we can activate search okay so it was possible to do it and now we have another nexus of fate uptick with Karn get an island uptick with Teferi find nexus of fate this is, yeah okay this is just fantastic so that's great guys we'll see you in round three hey guys welcome to round three and yeah we can't keep that uh this is a little slow but it's doable you don't need another land that's for sure let's try off glacial fortress and say go That is just, wow, drawing pretty well here, not going to lie. Are we playing against another red-white deck? Knight of Grace, okay. We'll just go ahead and gift a paradise. and Off to a pretty good start for a six-card hand. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we'll keep some of the wreckage. I might take the hit off this one. Yeah. Just chemistry's insight and end, end, end step. Oh yeah, play all the knights. Um, you know what? I don't mind keeping this. Let's play Hitcher Land Harbor. I, this kind of telegraphs what we have. Um... I, I think I'll keep the roots there. If we draw to fairy, that becomes really good. Now, our opponent is incentivized to make a really big attack here, and they do. Alright. Down to Vanguard is the follow up play. Glacial Fortress, I can go in the graveyard. And hey, look at that, we drew Teferi. Let's uptick Teferi. And another root snare. Okay. Lyra, sure. Go ahead and root snare, protect that to fairy. Uh, we don't need another one. Transform search, Karn, sweet. Another root snare is good. Play Karn, start upticking Karn. Then we actually have root snare plus activate search. Or, um, Silent Wreckage. Feeling pretty good about where we're at right now. Oh no, that a lot. That, now we can't settle the wreckage. Yikes. Okay, so we gotta find a way out of this one. And luckily, we have a bunch of fogs to, uh, To kind of see what we can do here. Oh boy. Alright, we'll take another root snare. Bam! We did it. It's just uptick with Karn. Oh, they gave us the search, eh? Okay. Uh, I'll play it. Draw. We can play Nexus of Fate. Set a stop on our end step. Oh, okay. Our opponent's just had enough. Uh, that was quick. Um, again, I think we're going to probably stick with the same sideboard plan. Can't really complain. Yep, take out a blink, a search, and a discovery. It's been working, been working well for us so far. All right.
that a poem? What do you got? What do you got? Not a bad hand again, a little slow. Okay, now our lands all come into play untapped, which is nice. Alright, go ahead and play search. Kinda wanna run this night out. Get rid of this history. Okay. I'm, I talked myself into it. I think it's pretty good. Trades with one of their creatures. Ooh, Field of Ruin, eh? Okay. And then we'll block the, uh, the one that takes the most damage for us. Give us a land. Okay. Perfect. My absolute favorite play in standard right now. Teferi, untap, hold up uh, root snare. Ooh, the gift will be good for next turn. Crap, you mortal son. I had to deal with that one last last round, but hey, we were able to fight through it even without uh, the um, knights. All right, let's give to paradise. All right, Lyra pumps up Arulia. Shalai, holy smokes! You know what we need? We need a cleansing nova. Nexus of Fate. Blink of an eye. Okay. I think we're going to keep that. Play the island. Can we blink with kicker? On tap? I think so. Uh, no. No, we can't. Okay. No, we'll just cast it. That's fine. Mm, that doesn't really do a whole heck of a lot. Set us up on our end step. Tap, untap, cast Nexus. Graveyard. Ugh, yuck. Come on, something good, something good. Hmm. Cast Chemistry's Insight. Root Snare is nice. I am okay with that. Discovery Dispersal is pretty good, actually. We have... We do. We actually have Dispersal Mana plus Root Snare. Okay. Oh no, the auto tapper. Oh, jeez. Okay. For some reason, the auto tapper always wants to use the gift of paradise mana first. Oh, 
Oh. Really? Okay. Um, does our opponent just lose? We have mission briefing fa flashback roots now, right? Yep. Okay. Sure. <laughs> Yeah, I imagine there's a concession coming up here. Mm-hmm. Mission briefing. Okay, there it is. All right, guys, it's a great round three. We'll see you guys in round four. Hey, guys, welcome to round number four with Bant Fog, and we got a pretty good hand here. I I would probably never mulligan a uh, turn two search, turn three gift, or turn it to be a turn four gift. Looks like is this mono green? I was gonna say green black, but this looks uh, uh, this looks like straight green. Steel leaf champion. Uh, yeah, straight green. Okay. Wow, Steel Leaf Champion into Steel Leaf Champion. Holy smokes. Uh, I think I gotta get rid of that. And yikes. Um, Alright, let's... I guess we gotta... Gain, gain, gain some life here. Oh, red. Okay. Okay, alright. I wonder what the red's for. Holy smokes, do I have to find something quick. Yep, we'll graveyard that. Oh boy. I almost think we have to take another turn here. Just kind of cycle this Nexus of Fate. No, we don't want that. No, well, that doesn't work either. But let's try again. Okay. Yay. 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 Okay, we'll keep that. We'll keep that. Alright. Can we just get back in this game? Cool. Alright. Now there is a there is a non-zero chance we do brick off here. Oh wow, that's a ballsy attack. Okay. Okay, we 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 can beat this. Our opponent just has roughly a million power. Uh, we're gonna draw this. Um, okay, we'll play that. I mean, like, I could have held it for Chemistry's Insight, and you know what? In fact, I probably should have. Wow, really no fear, eh? I don't want either of these. Pause for reflection. Sure. Okay. Graveyard transform. Uh oh. Okay. So we'll play this. Activate search. I guess we'll take pause for reflection. I really hope we don't brick off after all of this effort to fight back. Man. Okay, well, it looks like we're going to get to ult this to fairy. Uh, 
discovery dispersal, sure. Okay. It's got one. Hmm, interesting. Okay. Well, let's get to ferry up to eight here. Okay. See, now I'm happy I didn't. Oh, there we go. Okay. Now I'm happy I didn't. Uh... Okay, and our opponent can see. Wow, I cannot believe we won that one. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got here. Um, hmm. Cleansing Nova seems good. We saw a Carnage Tyrants. We need a couple in the gates. For uh, Planeswalkers, possibly. I, to be honest, I don't know. I've never seen this deck before. But I didn't see any enchantment, problematic enchantments out of them. They're not playing white, so I don't think it's worth it to bring in Knight of Autumn. Alright, opponent. Whew. That might be the worst thing I've ever seen. Yikes. Alright, we'll go ahead and keep it. And sure. Yeah. Hinterland Harbor off the top would be the best draw. And another forest, eh? Okay. Oh my goodness. Wow. I think I just lost, to be honest. Man, I didn't expect that. Oh, holy crap, I'm screwed. <laughs> holy smokes. Man, I just get annihilated. I think... I mean, we'll fight the good fight like we did in, in the first one. Okay, well, that's a start. We, we gotta wait another turn before we can do something about it, but... I imagine we might be taking four here. And I was correct. Not only are we taking four, we're taking an additional three. From this hasty dinosaur. And all of a sudden, our opponent has a ton of power on board. Holy smokes. Well, we can get some extra mana here and hold up root snare. And the reason I have to hold up root snare is because I'm pretty sure they can just slam Galta. Yeah, and it has haste. And we're taking four. Oh my goodness. So when I said uh, I didn't see any problematic enchantments, I was not lying. That did not mean there wasn't problematic enchantments to worry about. We do have a cleansing nova here. I'm pretty sure. Like, we, we don't have the option, right? Like, it's got to be just... Ugh, what do I do? I could hold up pause for no, no. Everything, everybody's done. Holy smokes! Mm -hmm. Oh no! Oh no! I can't. I can't actually beat Sarkin's rage. That is just ridiculous. Like. Oh, I also think I just killed myself. Haha. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wait, no. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yes, I did. I needed that land to come in untapped. Because now they hit me for four, I go to four. They All they gotta do is cast Registrar Alpha, and I die. Wow. What an annihilation. Okay, so let's get... Uh... Hmm. I know I want. I know I want the Knight of Autumns. So we could. I mean, are we just? Yeah, we basically just went back to the same sideboard plan that we did for the other three matchups.
Okay. This is a risky keep, but any green source makes this hand uh, fantastic. And I can actually... Oh, okay, that, that's not a bad draw either. I was going to say I could just... Uh, oh, no. I could mission briefing just to filter my draws. It's not... It's not the worst thing. Oh, instead I'll just do this. There we go. I'm, gonna, I'm actually going to keep both of these. Alright. Okay, now we're off to the races here. Alright. Uh, no. No. Oh, come on. It always wants to use the basics first. And I am not playing this Knight of Autumn until I know that I am in the clear of Sarkin's Rage. Thrashing Brontodon, eh? Are they going to use that right away? Looks like they are. Okay, I think I'm going to Mission Briefing here. For no actual value. Uh, I think I like both of these. Sure. I'll just pass. I, uh, I probably should have just played Teferi. Oh, no, Teferi would have just died. Alright. Cleansing Nova. Oh, another Registrar Alpha. Oh, but dear, 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 dear. Um, do I just have to pass? I think I do. Oh, that's so rough. Yep. I need them to overextend here and to settle the wreckage. That's a pretty sweet combo, actually. Death Court Scavenger and Registrar Alpha. Tax is a 5-4 when it comes down. Doesn't matter because I did settle them. Which is good. My opponent overextended. Drover, sure. Okay. Okay. Now what? I think we Teferi. We Teferi. Can we gift and Teferi? We cannot. Thrashing Bronton on. Well, I'm glad we didn't play Gift. Now I'm going to try to... Ugh. This stinks. <sighs> the second mission briefing wasn't bad. Uh, yeah, I can just cleansing over here. Okay, let's do that. And we'll draw another Teferi. Okay. That sounds good to me. Death Gord Scavenger. Sure. I'm I'm out of mission briefings anyway. Okay, so I think we yeah, now we have enough mana to gift. Play to fairy. And I think we're gonna just tuck this Death Gord, Death Gord Scavenger. Okay. Now we need our opponent to be on nothing. That's not nothing. But we brought in our super secret sideboard tech for that, which isn't all that secretive, but that needs to get out of here. And our opponent scoops it up. Fantastic. Come from behind victory. We'll see you guys in round number five. Hey, guys. Welcome to round number five. This is going to be the last one. I don't want to make this video too long. Alright, so, Mono Blue Tempo, eh? Okay. This is a match we haven't played yet, so that's good. Uh, 
Yeah, I think I'm okay with one land here. We have Gift of Paradise next turn. Tempest Jin. Sure. Play Gift. Target our basic. Doesn't really matter because this deck only plays islands. Storm Tamer. Pause for Reflection is good because it allows us to. Like, this is probably going to get countered here, but we don't have a choice. We need to play into it. And if they end up tempoing us out, they end up tempoing us out, which is fine. Okay. Opt to the bottom. Okay. Well, let's try it again. Oh, this one resolves. Nice. So, we do have pause for reflection. I mean, it might have been correct to do it upkeep. Because they could, they could have drawn a counter spell there. And it looks like they did. Rats. Alright. Oh, another Teferi. Let's give it a shot. Let's draw... Search. Alright, let's play Discovery Dispersal. I think we'll keep a blink of an eye. I know the Styron Storm Tamer counters it, but it's the closest thing to a removal spell. And this is probably going to save us five life. So upkeep will return this to their hand. Oh, they're just going to... Okay. I guess I'm not dead, but like pretty close. Another Storm Tamer. Alright, let's take another turn. Oh my god. Okay, uh, we're dead. Let's uh, see if we can do better in round number two. So I like the Cleansing Novas, and I think I like the Negates, or the Carnage Tyrants. I think the Carnage Tyrants are probably better, to be honest. Bring those in as a win con, something they can't counter. Get rid of uh, some useless stuff. I don't want to say useless stuff, we'll get rid of some less useful stuff. Alright, we're going to play. Sure, yeah, this hand seems very reasonable. Mist Cloak Herald. Hey, Carney T. Let's give us a couple islands. I'll just take one. I think one one's probably good. want to make sure we hit these land drops. Some of the wreckage is nice. Hope this doesn't get countered. Okay, it doesn't. So it's nice to know they don't have spell pierce in hand. Because I imagine that would have been a prime target for it. Um, let's just pass the turn. Leave upset all the wreckage. So if this baits out a counter spell, that'd be great. One less counter spell for us to deal with. Okay. No follow up plays? Okay, well, I guess we played Carney T. Trickster does nothing to Carney T. Tempest Gin, sure. Okay. Let's play Teferi. 
Yeah, let's play Teferi. Okay, so meets in the gate, sure. We're going to attack. I will happily take the trade for the Tempest Gin. Okay, they don't, okay, that's not, that's not a good sign. Alright. Chart a course, sure. Alright, let's swing with Kearney T. We could go for the win here with Nexus of Fate, but okay. Alright, alright. So, Storm Tamer, sure. We're gonna come in with eight. Okay, so that is lethal, so I got a root snare. They're gonna counter it, okay. Now I'm gonna root snare again. And they don't have a counter, okay. So now I swing in with Carnage Tyrant, and the only thing I lose to here is Spell Pierce. So they're going to make a block. I can only pay one. Oh, no! <laughs> oh, boy. All right, guys. I think that's enough. Hey, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Uh, if you guys... If you guys uh, want to pick up a deck that uh, is uh, kind of competitive, but more so uh, super fun to play, then I highly recommend Band Fog. Uh, thanks again for watching. Click like if you like this video. Click subscribe if you really liked it. Tell all your friends, and I will see you next time.